Lymph nodes are integral components of the immune system. Lymphatic vessels bring fluid, which is filtered for harmful substances such as infection and cancer. When a lymph node meets these things, it often enlarges, either because it is mobilizing cells to fight infection or inflammation, or cancer cells, which it has filtered out, are growing inside. There are hundreds of lymph nodes throughout the body. The main lymph node groups, which you can access on physical examination, are cervical, axillary, epitrochlear, inguinal and popliteal. Don't forget the tonsils and spleen. These can also be examined, are part of the lymphatic system and can be involved in the response to infections, inflammation and cancer. The clues which point to the lumping a lymph node are the lump is in a typical area, for example, neck, axilla, epitrochlear area, groin or behind the knee. It is not typical for another cause, such as an epidermal cyst, fibroepithelial polyp, lipoma, wart, abscess, skin cancer, aneurysm, etc. There is evidence of pathology which could be expected to cause a lymph node to enlarge, for example, inflammation, infection or neoplasia. If you don't know what areas of the body drain into each lymph node group, you won't know where to look for pathology and may miss the underlying diagnosis. Review your anatomy. Also, make a decision. Is the lymphadenopathy isolated to a particular lymph node group, suggesting local pathology, or is it more generalised, suggesting a process such as leukaemia, lymphoma, TB, HIV, etc.? Remember to watch out for the red flag B symptoms, which can indicate a lymphoma, such as night sweats, unexplained weight loss of more than 10% of body weight in the past six months, unexplained fever greater than 38 degrees Celsius. If clinically indicated, you can also check the identity of the lump using radiological tests, for example ultrasound, and or by taking a fine needle aspirate or biopsy. But be careful, don't biopsy an aneurysm. So, in summary, if you encounter a lump, decide, is it a lymph node? If so, why is it enlarged? And is the enlargement due to a local disease process or a more generalized problem?